Hi there everyone and welcome back to our review for multiplayer series featuring myself, Berg787, Torio and Grey Hunter. Say hello chaps. Hello. Hello. Good stuff, let's get back on the way. So, wouldn't you know it, just as Poland is about to get its ass kicked unless you two bail it out, this would be the one time that somebody of my dynasty is going to get elected most likely. Could you accept? Yeah, if you accepted, excellent, thank you. What did you do? Oh, you asked me for military access. Yes, I will give you military access. Go forth, sir. I do need to ask for military Kill access things. from Bohemia, which is really stupid. Actually, no, I don't. I think I can get through. Yeah, I can. I can get through through Holland, through Netherlands, rather, because you border them. Oh, yeah, because I border them. Yeah. Who am I yeah. actually fighting oh, here? Speed. I don't even know. I'm just moving 20,000 troops up there, and I don't even know. You can go to Burgundy, but, or they're the closest enemy, uh, and then... I'll go and siege out Burgundy. Let's see, who are you actually fighting? Current actually, Burgundy wars. is sieging you out. I could go and do you a bit of a oh. favor and remove some of their troops from your land. You are currently fighting against Scandinavia, Burgundy, Tver, and Lithuania. Well, you can forget about Burgundy. I'll tell you about that now. You know what? I can take care of them. You can go to Scandinavia. No, I'm all right. I'm already there, almost. Yeah, but I would consider taking the land... Maybe I don't want you to take the land. <laughs> I figured as much. Alright, France is pretty happy with me as is, so I'm going to stop improving relations with them and improve them with Brandenburg instead in the hope that Brandenburg, if it becomes emperor, will like me enough to give me an electorate. Actually, I'm going to need you to jump in here. I'm going to get beat otherwise. Oh no, I managed to hold them off. Sorry. Come on. We've almost won this siege. Surrender, damn you. Come on. Give me more troops. Oh, I can't get in there now because you're like blocking the way. No, it's the <laughs> fourth thing, probably. Oh, yeah, probably. You know, because maybe. Don't you. Do you have military access from France? Because I think yeah, I went through their territory somehow. No. Who else is in this war? Why am I just. Burgundy, Lithuania, and Scandinavia. So my otherwise totally mediocre heir is actually a decent general. Good. <sighs> now yeah. I kind of want him to die in battle. <laughs> well, Even though he's actually got siege ability. Yeah, I know, but now that he's actually proved himself to be not totally useless, I'm kind of feeling bad about my decision. <laughs> I immediately regret this decision. Well, not immediately regret. He hasn't died yet. He's not even in charge of an army yet. Right. Poland, where is where are your troops, you dumbass? Oh, there they are. Dead. No, there they are. They're, they're all right. Oh, they've got 19,000 troops just sitting there. Yeah, because I'm coming. Oh, I can't get to Scandinavia. Oh, no, they, they've got, like, with of... Moldova, they've got, like, a 29 stack sieging. Oh, you sons now. of bitches. What? I was sieging Burgundy to take the land, and Poland accepted a separate peace with them, taking <laughs> war reparations. Oh well. You might as well come over here then and fight. I, no, seriously, together we can really bash the shit out of them here. Because Poland have got plenty of troops over here, and we're both... Yeah, but I'm still moving my troops from the British Isles. It's going to take a while. I have... Yeah, you've still got 25,000. Yeah, you've got, you've got like about 25,000 on the mainland, though, haven't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So there we go. And this isn't colluding, by the way. This is us fighting a legitimate war, defending one of our allies. So you're both allies yeah. with the same person. So I think that's totally fair. Yeah, there's, there's, that's not the House von Wittelbach is shaken. Do we deny things or do we acknowledge them? We deny, deny them. <laughs> well, it's a choice between legitimacy loss and prestige loss. So it was an actual thought for a moment. What exactly is the war goal here? Better take Marienburg. Where is Marienburg? Uh, it's north of Poland. It's taken. There we go. By Brandenburg. Who aren't actually in this war. war. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's because they're fighting Scandinavia with me. Well, I think this is the first time where we've all genuinely been involved in a war at the same time. Mm, mm -hmm. Yes, I think so. Well, shit, you might need to come down here, Tori, real quick, because I'm about to get hit by some... Oh, no, I'm not. Uh, where? No, it's all right. They were Polish troops. Sorry, I thought they were Lithuanian troops. <laughs> <laughs> I'm moving to the north of Lithuania to siege some stuff. Don't panic, don't panic. Prices. Right, let's see. The Lithuanian flag Stick thing up. is kind of similar to what the Moldovan one is. And Moldovia have got like um, 
What, so Moldovan red. is a bull and Lithuanian is a man on the yeah, horse. Yeah, I know, but they're just red. And I looked at All them right. and it freaked me out. They were moving in my direction. I was like, oh no, who would be moving in my direction? <laughs> they were heading vaguely in my direction. I no, was they walked through terrified. the province that I'm sieging. Whoops. Just lost the navy carrying uh, 13,000 men. Oh, wow, okay. National. Well done. <laughs> oh, now you're going to get it, Scandinavia. Oh, Build you became a Dutchie. Good job. You know what? Build oh. 20 heavies. Okay, so I'm kind of happy, but kind of disappointed. Expensive. On the one hand, Aquilia is now a duchy, so I can actually make nice with them like feudal monarchies do. On the other hand, the ruling dynasty is no longer the Sforzas. I'm sad. No. This depresses me. <laughs> Damn. On the other hand, Austria's territory is all occupied, except for one tiny little province. Which Bohemia is taken care of. Suck it, Habsburgs. I got annoyed and I'm building heavies everywhere. <laughs> you just got annoyed. That's, it. That's what I do when I get angry. I just commission loads of ships to be built. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to see me when I'm angry. I build heavy ships. What's the capital of Lithuania? Good mm. question. It should be um, Vilna in the north. Vilnius. Isn't it? Yes, it is. It is. And it's the been, Poland is sieging it. Yeah, yeah. Nom nom nom. <laughs> I just still hope to be friends with Lithuania after that. Come on, Brandenburg, end this stupid war you've got with fucking... They can't. We have positive 1% war score. Because I want to be able to go and take the war goal. Because that's going to help us out. Well... I would be happy if the war ended as well, but we don't have enough war score to do so. This is my we only don't have fun any that I can have, actually. because because obviously I'm warned. <laughs> <laughs> because obviously I am busy being warned. Hmm. All right, um, let's make some more transport ships to let's go siege this then. There we go. No, what, what, okay, Scandinavia so is too busy is in the other war, aren't they? So that's why we're not really seeing much of what they're, they're not. They've not really mm. brought any troops over. Well, their navy is blockading my know. capital. Oh, I can see I all your see ships that you've built. Troops. That's quite funny. You've got like tons of heavy ships <laughs> <laughs> just sitting there in port. Uh, I am building ships in every province in Great Britain that I own, so I will be able to crush their fleet relatively soon. But it will take some time. Two or three Relatively years. Relatively soon, but it will take some time. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Three years, approximately. Zurich has come under our occupation. Jolly I'm good. just going to remove that... Um, I'm just going to cancel that military access that you gave me for the time being, just so I'm not losing... Um... Oh, yeah, sure. I don't think I need it either. Actually, no, I don't need it, because I'm fighting in an eternal war inside the empire so i have access through everybody else brandenburg except a piece of switzerland good this pleases me okay building for 59 ships that should suffice <laughs> one would hope some more frigates Just a bit. All right, let's go and beat up. Some you might friends. actually have an opportunity here, Berg, because we're currently fighting Savoy, and depending on what sort of a peace Brandenburg is willing to accept, they might dismantle them for you. Do you think so? Maybe, because I'm pretty sure Burgundy has some claims on some of the stuff that's here, and a smaller, and Switzerland has some claims too. And a smaller Savoy might be small enough that Berg can eat stuff like uh, Navarra and Cremona, maybe Montferrat. Oh, the Aztecs got a doomsday, whatever that means. <laughs> it means that they're all about to fall apart, I think it is. They sacrificed people. Thoughts of heresy. Mm, yeah, Carpet sure. sieging Lithuania. Siege, siege, carpet, How is that siege. going? It's going pretty good. Ow. We've got we've got almost half of it sieged, pretty much. Coming yeah, Lithuania's not doing so good. 
The problem is I'm we don't have the war goal, which is <laughs> rather annoying. But indeed. But we still oh, got positive it's... twenty war score, so. Spain has now got almost all of uh, the Inca region. Actually, how far can I see over there? I still can't really see more than just the Caribbean. Yeah, I can't either. Wow, there's still tons of places to be conquered here, in, or to be colonized in the Caribbean. I'm quite surprised. Mm, yeah, I left my colonial nation to do the work. And I actually forgot about my army here. They're not doing a great That's... job about it, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> They're just sort of half arsing it. Ah, uh, excellent. I will take extra diplomatic tech, thank you. How far into Scandinavia can I get? Quite far, alright. Alright, so Corsica would accept vassalization, but I'm in a war, so... Hmm. I can take oh the idea of organized recruitment, which is completely crap. You build troops faster. It leads to better things, though. Yeah. So it's not totally worthless. Well, on its own, uh, I would never take that, even for hundred <laughs> points. Even Who for a million a points. points. Well, especially not for a million points. Huh. That's annoying. So basically, if we want to win this war, I think we have to go and fight Lithuania. Well, come along. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Join in the party. Yeah, There's I'm still come some room left here. There's plenty still to do. Mm -hmm. It's a big country, man. I'm coming to join you. We still have positive relations. So you and Lithuania, they're like, all right, we yeah. understand. I mean, you were just honoring a call, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Killing your fault. Our people, but yeah, you're fine. But that's what happens. I broke alliances with Saxony in previous recording sessions, and right after the war was over, they were like, hey, would you like to be friends again? No, not really. So this, this, this war that Austria are in, is that part of the war that you're in? Yes. Right, because they're just a non-entity at the moment. They've been fully... Wow, I see what you mean about Saxony. I mean, so rather Savoy. Savoy have been absolutely butt-fucked. Yep. I conquered four provinces. Uh, Arnholt is even getting in on the action. And they're a single province minor. Oh, hello. Okay, found the Sc Scandinavian troops. Where? They're hanging out in... Marienburg. Oh, the war goal. Oh shit, don't come mm -hmm. after me. Oh crap. I'm about to get ruffle stomped by a bunch of uh, Scandinavian troops. I mean, by a bunch. Oh no, maybe not. Where are they going? Oh, no, they've, come, they've, come, the they've come down there. Yeah, that's alright. I can jump in there if I can oh. get there in time. I don't think you'll get there in time. Yeah, Burgundy got some land back out of that fight. Really? And yeah. Genoa is now a country. So is Montferrat. And Milan is now a country too. Yes, that is actually a good opportunity for some of us. Not mm. for me, not for you, Lucas. Well, it's good for me at the Wow, you've got time. a massive army just hanging out there, um, <laughs> Toriel. Uh, the north one, uh, it's going to Norway to siege stuff. I need to move away from that army of Lithuanians down at the south here. I'm kind of like the only one really that near to them, so let's get away <laughs> from them that's bit bigger than my army. Come on, Brandenburg, come on. If you want to fight the Scandinavians, I will help you. But we have to go fight them together. No? Okay. I guess we're just going to... Oh, we're the gonna Scandinavian go Navy Denmark, left me. Be. Wonderful. I like how this entire war is just kind of ignoring the Scandinavian troops hanging out in Marienburg. We're just like, nah, we're cool. <laughs> we're gonna go besiege these other places. I could instead. ally Tunis. Interesting. Really? Yeah. Well, they're quite big, but it's poor, poor land. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. It's just I got like rival of a rival, you know, mission. Ah, of course. I'm pretty sure these Lithuanian troops are following me around. <laughs> they don't like you. Attached to me. Ah, there we go. Thank you, Poland. What happened? Oh dear. Uh, Poland is dealing with those troops, those Scandinavian troops I saw before. Yeah. And Muscovy jumped out of our war, which isn't the worst thing in the world. Actually, the fact that they Poland weren't really is... helping. Um, the fact that Poland was dealing with those troops was a very bad decision on their part. They should have waited until the province was besieged, because it's the war goal of our war. 
I've lost track yes, of where my troops are. I don't know where they are. I personally don't care about. You can use the ledger on the right, the small ledger, to find them. Ah, oh, there we go. We won. Bohemia. Is the war Hang over? Excellent. So pause this. Just gonna pause because we won. The Evangelical Union is victorious. The war of religion in the Empire has ended in a victory for the Protestants. The Emperor has been forced to abdicate and Protestantism is now the dominant faith in the Empire. So Bohemia is now Emperor. They are indeed. And Scandinavia is going to see Danzig, Hanover and Stolp to Brandenburg. Austria releases Alsace, Venice and Verden as sev as separate states, so Venice is now a single province minor in Trevisio. Mm -hmm. uh, Protestant is the official faith of the Holy Roman Empire, and Austria got its ass handed to it. Good. Thank God for um, that they didn't take the war goal. <laughs> that would have been amusing. So, oh, Bohemia okay. became emperor. emperor. Me. Nah! <laughs> Why did Bohemia become emperor? That Peasants war no in the sense. Ottomans. Oh. Good. Take that. Man, I need to get out of this military war, so hurry up and let's siege this, you. because I, I've got plans now, because I've got rid of my overextension and all that. Hmm. He has plans. In fact, I'm just coming home. Forget your war now. You should be out of hold out now. There we go. Right. How do I get back home, actually? That's a good point. <laughs> well, you should be able to just walk straight back yeah, through I Bohemia, yeah, shouldn't you? I can. I can walk through Bohemia through you and through Austria, funnily enough. I don't think you can walk through me anymore because you don't have it says I can. access. Like, I've got, like, the oh, route, okay. you know, when you've clicked to go back home and then it gives you the, like, little arrow thing, like the path. Hmm. You'll see me in a second. I'm about to come through. Good news. I'm not actually needed up there anymore, so that's why I'm coming. Hmm. Okay, so there's only six electors. Do you see me? Here I am. And it looks like... Hello! Hello. Man, my advisors be just keep students. fucking dying. Like, every week. <laughs> the buy a new advisor. <laughs> yeah, right. This is interesting. I thought for a second Bohemia would lose straight away, but no, they won't. It's a tie, so Bohemia will get the next election victory as well. Which is lucky for them, because their current king is 72 years old. It is lucky for them. That would have been embarrassing if they'd just been emperor for like three weeks. A university, yes please. Lots of events popping up. I want to do some stuff. Whoops, I lost the battle. Where? Where? <laughs> oh. Curses. No. Right, so Brandenburg really Run away. Me. Run away. Would they care if I did this? Yeah, Lithuania yes. came to help their allies. Let's get rid of that. Milan. How you doing, buddies? Are you going to kill them? Yeah, I mean, it's all... I could make them a... Uh... Hold on one second. Let me just... You could probably just vassalize them, couldn't Not you? Not yet, really. I need to get rid of um, Corsica. Or Mantua. You know, going over the um, relations limit is not such a bad thing. I do it quite often. If you vassalize someone... Actually, I'm just going to take Mantua. Fuck it. <laughs> well, I don't have a claim on it, actually, so let's make sure we get one. Because that's all I need once I've got that. And then we're um, we're good to go for Italy. I've seized half of Scandinavia, but my individual war score is 3%. Well, we've got the war goal now, Des. I wonder what you're going to get from that. Because Scandinavia might get. Uh, oh wow! I've just seen how much of Scandinavia is released. Hmm. Oh wow! Novgorod. When did they appear? Novgorod. Yep. When Moscovy got itself beaten right, up by okay. Scandinavia. They're back. Hello, Novgorod. Yep. 
Nice to I, see you. My Russian is a bit rusty, but I think Novgorod means uh, new city. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Well, Nov Novi I would mean, means new, and Gorad sounds kind of like a city. Grad is in Croatian. Mm. Novi Grad. It's funny. There's a place there called Novi Sad, which means literally new now. New yeah. now, right now. Well, sa Sad is yeah. orchard in Polish. Well, that means because it's in um, Novi Sad, I think, is in Serbia. New now. Is that now in Serbian? Yeah, well, Croatian and Serbian is pretty much the same. Just they use Cyrillic, and we use um, Latin. I mean, there's there's certain different words and stuff like that, but on the whole, like, I mean. Similar. Well, it's, it's it is pretty much the same as I said, apart from some certain different words. But like you'd have no interesting like a, choice. You'd have no problem understanding one another. So Bohemia chose the Hansa as an elector, which is pretty clever on their part because the Hansa can't be emperor. Hmm. Oh, well played, Bohemia. Verdun has well been released. Played. Yep. Hello, fabricate claim. What's my um? Yeah, are you sure you want to do that though? Because the emperor will probably fight. Fight me! Is that what the and emperor again, will do? You can probably win because you've got Spain and France. I don't know. I'll try to do it without the emperor joining, if it's possible. Actually, you know what? It's probably better well, if I. It might not be because they might. Oh no! You're lucky. <laughs> they usually release Verdun as a free city, as I've found in my games. Let's Which go. is very irritating, because the Emperor can't decline. Man, this war that we're in is annoying me now. I don't want to be part of it. I don't <laughs> want to play anymore. Well, no, I'm just bored of it. I'm done. I am done. Okay, I have a question for you, Torio. Are you going to be annoying Great Britain for more of their land? I would, I would love to be annoying Great Britain for all of their land. So, eventually, your plan is to take Great Britain. Yes, it is. Yes. What about new okay. now? Is your plan to take case. any new now? Oh wow, you've got a big fleet, man. In that case, I'm ships. not interested in England. In an alliance? Yeah. Do they offer you an alliance? Yeah. Well, they said on the uh, on the menu that they would be happy to have an alliance and a royal marriage, and I was considering it, but not if it means that I'm going to have to defend them in a war that I really don't give a shit about. Right. If it was in any way relevant to me, if they had more of their land, then maybe. But you've eaten most of Who them. Who are Lorraine so and how big are they? The meal. Lorraine is uh, one Lorraine province minor south of me. Oh shit, you know what? I've just realized I'm still being warned by, uh, by the Ottomans. Why do you want Lorraine? Want Lorraine. Oh, well, Lorraine allied with yeah, somebody Lorraine that you were attacking. I'm a bit worried here if I was to right. declare war on Mantua. Or the Ottomans jump in. The no, they might. Really looking very, really very scary scene. right now. Sorry, the two people talking at once. I didn't really get what was said. Lucas, go first. They might because they're really close to you now. They can actually get to you. Because they've just, got that massive fleet. I was fleet. just saying that the Ottomans are looking very scary. Well, France, Bohemia, Corsica would all join in. For my side. Hmm. Improve relations with Ravensburg. Do I care? Are they still a free city? They're still a free city. I don't give a shit. Austria is reformed. Oh. Damn. What? Really? Austria is reformed? Well, yeah, but that's a problem for me because you're Defender of the Faith, Berg. So if I I'm not Defender Austria, of the Faith. You will join. I thought you were. Yeah. Oh. Of the Reformed it's Faith, aren't you? No, I'm not Defender of it. I am reformed, but I'm not a Defender of the Faith. Oh, good. Hold on, I need to pause it for a second because I need to work out what my next this idea is going to be. Probably should pause it anyway because it's oh, yeah, it is about time. time for I'm, I'm... Oh, I'll think about that off camera. Um, but again, people, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episodes, please support whoever's uh, version of uh, events in history you are um, currently keeping an eye on. And until next time, take care. Bye-bye. See ya. Bye.